Welcome everyone to the Magical Frequency. In the very beginning of this meditation, I will be discussing the idea for how this came about and how to best use it. The meditation start point will be marked here. I will be synthesizing concepts from Neville Goddard, The Gateway Experience Tapes, Dr. Joe Dispenza's My Movies, and Dr. William Benningston. I will leave all of their work in the description box below. I will also be incorporating other healing sound techniques from Reiki and other ancient drumming sounds. These will happen throughout the meditation. The practices in this meditation is to make your manifestations always run with ease in the background, just like you're able to breathe without thinking. This meditation will continue to subconsciously reprogram you with every single practice. Just one experience with this meditation, you will receive wonderful things from the universe working in your favor, and many revelations have continued to light your path forward and make life easier. Quantum affirmations will also be added and repeated during this meditation, which will activate your quantum power and creation ability. You can use this meditation to help activate healing or most commonly manifest desires. This meditation is best used either in the very morning waking hours or right before sleep. I challenge you to use the power of intention. There is a magic when you set an intention and then observe the intention. Perhaps in this infinite quantum field when we're exploring these other dimensions, we're observing the desires that we want. I will be instructing you to create your own unique sigil and use this frequently to enhance your meditation and your manifestation and any other healing you might be looking for. Please be aware this is an attempt to combine multiple different meditative and manifestation techniques into one video to condense it and synthesize it the most powerful approach to all of these different techniques in one succinct meditation. Please, Please do, do this, this in, in a safe, safe comfortable, comfortable area. area. Let's, Let's get started. started. Close your eyes and take a few deep breaths allowing your body to relax. Let go of any tension or stress as you prepare to engage in this meditation. Any negative emotions can now be released you can envision anything that makes you feel comfortable to put these things into and just melt them away into the universe. You can envision a boat where you can put all your feelings that make you unhappy or make you dissatisfied or things that make you fearful as they are not needed in this realm. Put them all in the boat and slowly move the boat into eternity. are valid, however they are meant to be felt and 
drifted away into the universe so you can experience all the wonderful and positive things that life has to offer. Now, now, we have let go of all, all of those all things. things. Let's visualize a sphere of light above you, radiating energy and healing frequencies. Envision this light slowly descending, surrounding you with a cocoon of warmth and comfort. Feel its gentle, calming presence as it permeates your entire being. Feel the warmth and energy emanating from this light all the way over your head, radiating down your body. Feel this energy and warmth in your palms, flowing down into your feet. Imagine this energy as a vibrant, glowing light from your hands into your head. All of the points are flowing, glowing, vibrant, and connected. Everything is quantum enchanted. As you maintain this focus, focus your intent on what you would like to achieve from this meditation. Continue to visualize the energy flowing through your hands as a stream of healing light, penetrating and harmonizing any areas in need of balance within your body. Picture this light dissolving any discomfort or imbalance, replacing it with a sensation of ease and vitality. Make sure to think about your intentions for this meditation. If it is a certain state that you desire, think about this state. If it is a certain physical manifestation that you desire, think about that thing. Now, we're going to go into the exercise of creating sigils. We will create five of those sigils with five different items that you would like to manifest. Please think of five separate different things that are only going to benefit you. You are not thinking about other people. Please think of five different tangible things that you would like to achieve for yourself. Please think of things that you do not truly have. Please think of things that will benefit you. Please think of things that will not impose upon any other person or cause any harm. Please keep each individual desire separate and have distinct other areas that you would like to manifest. Think of everything as a separate entity, frequency, and energy, and create a sigil for it. We want to frequently think of these five sigils after we've created them for the desires that we are looking to manifest. We want to think of these during the day when we are doing mundane tasks, and we will practice that right now. A sigil is a symbol or design that encapsulates your intent. You can start out by having a picture or a written statement, condensing it by removing vowels and duplicate letters, combining letters to create a unique symbol, or if it's a special thing, create your own unique symbol in your mind 
for this sigil. Begin now by focusing on the sigil you created. Let it draw your attention, infusing your mind with the intent. Hold each sigil in your mind's eye, visualizing it glowing with a vibrant energy. Create five separate sigils right now and think and concentrate on each individual sigil. Hold its focus and I will guide you through each individual sigil. After you have created your first sigil, go to create your second. Repeat the process. I will now give you time to create your second, third, fourth, and fifth sigil. Make these symbols vibrant and easy to remember in your mind's eye. Let's activate each sigil. Let's activate sigil one. Think of your first sigil and think of the actual visualization of this image in your mind. Let the light flow to it and dissolve any discomfort you're feeling. Know that whatever this is within the desire of the sigil is yours. Let's repeat this process for the second sigil. Let's repeat this process for the third sigil. Let's repeat this process for the fourth sigil. Let's repeat this process for the fifth sigil.
We are now going to do a meditative activity where we are going to flow through the sigils one by one. You will hear a rhythmic pattern and you should go into a flow state and actively visualize all of your sigils. Visualize the first, second, third, fourth, and fifth all in a row, back to back, according to the rhythms that you hear. Please begin. Maintain the energy flowing while concentrating on your sigils. Feel their energy continuously streaming into your hands, from your head with a comforting light. Allow any sensations or visualizations that arise to guide the process. During this portion of the meditation, as the energy continues to flow, we are going to reinforce this process by affirming the power of the sigils. We are going to express gratitude for the healing energy it represents and the positive transformation taking place within you. You have the power. These meditations are only tools to help guide you back to your power within. ask you to cycle through these sigils and repeat the symbol in your mind frequently and as quickly as you are able to. The process here is to ignite a power within your being that will activate all of these symbols. Get into the feeling of gratitude, of possessing these desires as they are already out there. Think of your symbols now, now, now over, and over and over again. Over again. Let's get into the intention setting and observer effect affirmation portion of this video where we will activate this intention through these different affirmations in the quantum field. Through this meditation, I harness the power of intention to direct my focus and energy towards my being. I shape my thoughts and focus my mind, guiding my energies to restore my balance within. By using the sigils as representation of my intent, 
I channel my desires. The energy I manifest through these symbols acts as a beacon, drawing in the forces needed to transform my state of being. I am an active participant in the quantum realm, shaping reality through my attentive focus. Through my visualization, I engage with the observer effect. My focused attention and intention impact the quantum field, influencing the energy flow and restructuring the dynamics within my body. As I hold the intention of each sigil, the connection between my intention and the flow of energy contributes to the transformative process. I engage with the powerful interplay between thought, intention, and energy. By observing the manifestation process in this meditation, I actively participate in altering my reality. My observation and intent affect the energetic landscape, influencing the quantum field and initiating changes necessary for my well-being. Through this practice, I am empowered by the understanding that my consciousness and intention hold a profound influence. As an active observer, I acknowledge my role in shaping and directing my energies towards transformative effects within my being. For the remainder of this meditation, we will be cycling through all of the different sigils and focusing in on each one over and over again. You will be going one by one through all five, visualizing the symbol that you will be associating that specific manifestation with, and then visualizing yourself completing or doing Whatever that thing is, connect to it and feel as if it's yours and it is already here. Connect 
connect with the feeling of the fulfillment. Soon you will need to report that new things need to be put onto your list. If you were able to add more than five, please do so, as you will be recycling through all the received manifestations as you continue this practice. Continue this practice throughout your day when you are doing mundane tasks. Review your symbols, your images, your scenes over and over again, training your subconscious mind to always keep your goals in focus. This is another technique to help us in the manifestation process. Continue to regenerate and refine things, scenarios that you create for yourself, and harden these things into place. Solidify them and continue to repeat to them. If you find yourself in difficult situations, you can turn to your images and recite them and think of those positive or neutral thoughts to bring you back to a place where your subconscious can continue to realize what the important goals are and what should stay at the forefront of the subconscious. Continue to revisit your visualizations until your desired reality is achieved. Every night before you go to sleep, complete meditations that regenerate and reprogram your subconscious mind to keep the goals that you desire in the forefront of your mind, leading you over and over again to your desired life.
Repeat this process every night until you have crossed everything off of your list. This works best with a repetition. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more unique meditations just like this to help you achieve your higher consciousness realm. May you continue to manifest magic and resonate on your highest frequencies.